Hey Cream Madonnas, welcome back to the channel. I'm Belitra and I'm the Crafty Black Girl. You guys, we're into our next holiday basket and I am using a wrap box just to get started. You guys, this is going to be a kitchen essential, just some little decoration and kitchen utensil things for the holiday season because I know some people like to switch it up and they like to decorate their home. So I'm using that little tin pail. I'm going to pull the tags off of these kitchen towels. I'm going to fold them and put them inside of the pail along with this pot holder so i'm going to put the hot pot holder down and then i'm going to put the towel in and then this hand mitten inside but i'm taking all of the tags off then we're going to close back that little pail and i'm going to tape the sides of it to make sure that nothing pops out and our basket doesn't end up you know having things open and loose inside so now i'm going to use my skewers and we are going to attach the well not really attach but yes attach we're going to poke the skewers into the newspaper and then i'm going to attach the tape to the back of the pail to make sure that everything stays together stays up stands up so now i'm using these cookie cutters and i'm going to go ahead and cut off the top and attach this to the pail so that nothing moves and everything stays in its place this little spoon holder you guys i paid 30 cents for that these items were 90 percent off last year from dollar general and yeah so i thought this would be a perfect little basket we got these little holiday coasters that they can use on their kitchen tables or coffee table or whatever you desire so then i have this little truck uh with the christmas tree those are so cute just some decor you know for your kitchen and things so now i'm gonna put the shred inside you guys this is my same shred from last year from valentine so that's why i tell y'all get that 10 pound box from amazon and it will last you guys so yeah now i'm gonna add this tissue paper which i got the tissue paper from dollar general as well they had so many cute designs and i just picked up all of them you guys literally all of them and so yeah i have like tissue paper galore for, for the holidays so now i'm just going to go ahead and fold the sides of this this is how i create the back end of my basket so that they can't see the skewers or the tape or whatever else i have going on to keep everything up and i'm just going to take that tape i'm going to cover up the back like that and then we're going to turn it to the side and we're going to secure just with one piece of tape we're going to secure that back end of the basket just to the side so that you can't see until you, of course you take it apart but we want everything to look clean everything to look you know crisp and professional so i added this shrink wrap bag already you guys always check the description bar for the products that i use because i notice you guys do ask me sometimes but i make sure that i put all of the items that i use down below so now i'm going to use this floral ribbon this is satin floral ribbon and i'm going to use this to make a bow so i'm making a simple bow and you guys you can find this ribbon on amazon as well um this is what it looks like right now and then i'm just going to shrink wrap it of course and now this is what our little holiday kitchen decor basket looks like you guys so let me know if you like it down in the comments below if you like this video leave it a thumbs up you guys and give me a price down below what would you sell this for leave me a comment down below you guys don't forget all right and until next time you guys stay crafty Thank you.